Hello everyone, and thanks for tuning in. Today we will demonstrate how to calibrate a thermometer using the ice water bath and hot water bath methods. You can follow this procedure for calibration or as an accuracy check. Thermometers are important instruments used in food facilities. Thermometers are used to check the temperature of product to ensure it has reached the proper cook temperature that will render the product safe. Thermometers are also used to ensure that raw materials, ingredients, and product are held, stored, and transported at the appropriate temperature that will maintain its quality and safety. They are also used to ensure product is being cooled, thawed, and reheated safely. The first method that we will demonstrate is using an ice water bath. Step number one, fill a container with ice cubes in cold water and stir the water. Let the container stand for one to three minutes. Step number two, Stir the water again and place the thermometer in the bath without touching the sides or bottom of the container. Leave the thermometer in the container for at least five minutes. Step number three, read and record the temperature. The thermometer must read zero degrees Celsius or 32 degrees Fahrenheit plus or minus one degree. If the reading is not accurate, adjust the thermometer until it reads zero degrees Celsius. If it cannot be adjusted, replace it with a thermometer that can. Record the results on a calibration record and if any corrective action, such as an adjustment or replacement, was required. The second method that we will demonstrate is by using a hot water bath. Step number one, fill a pot with distilled water and bring the water to a boil. Once the water has reached a rolling boil, step number two is to place the thermometer into the water without touching the sides or bottom of the pot. Step number three, read and record the temperature. The thermometer must read 100 degrees Celsius or 212 degrees Fahrenheit plus or minus 1 degree. Note that the boiling point of water will vary with altitude. If the reading is not accurate, adjust the thermometer until it reads 100 degrees Celsius plus or minus 1 degree. Recheck to ensure the thermometer is reading 100 degrees Celsius. If it cannot be calibrated, replace it with a thermometer that can. Record the results on a calibration record and if any corrective action, such as an adjustment or replacement, was required. We hope you found this video on how to calibrate a thermometer helpful. For more information and resources on quality and food safety, please visit our website. If you have any questions, please contact one of our quality and food safety team members. Thanks for watching!